Uh, we're here to celebrate two things. One, I think the football field, and it was one of my first loves. I can remember doing two things on this football field. One, when I was five years old, I played t-ball. And about where this uh, yard line is, I uh, hit a ball right up the right to the first baseman, got tagged out, started crying, and my dad grabbed me and said, we're not going to cry when we get out in, in a sport. <laughs> my, next, my next one was uh, I was about uh, seven years old. I have a seven-year-old son here somewhere, and I came to watch a Fairfax High School football game, and I loved it. I don't know if it was the first game I ever watched, but I can remember walking up Sly Street. I live three blocks from here, and I looked right at my mom and said, someday I will quarterback the Fairfax, uh, the Fairfax Bulldogs, and eventually I did. The next thing, uh, we're here to celebrate nationalism. I taught the 7th and 8th graders, well, they would be juniors and seniors here at Fairfax, and I was going to find Alicia Clark and ask her what nationalism is, but I don't know where she is. She's out in the band somewhere. I hope that Alicia could be able to tell you that nationalism is love for country. And that's the main reason we're here today. Uh, when I was nine years old is when I learned to love my country. I was at my grandfather's funeral, and he had a uh, American flag draped on top of him. And I looked at my mom and said, why is that flag on him? And she said, because he was in the United States military, and that's something to be very proud of. So I'm very happy that uh, I'm here today to uh, welcome everybody to this ceremony and let the festivities begin.